Hey guys, HD here, and welcome to episode 88 of The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. So last time, we made our way to the shrine, and that sword over there. So I figured that I might as well just go ahead and, um, that I might as well go ahead get this cutscene. And then I have four different shrines to do. So I got a full schedule today with all kinds of stuff on the agenda. So it's pretty much mapped out everything I'm going to do. Honestly, I think this might be one of the easiest tiers to find. Because it's so small. Like, where could this be that I wouldn't see it? Oh, so that is so suspicious. You found me. Bye bye. Okay, so yeah. How could I not find a. It must be at the very tip. I mean. Ah, that was stupid. There we go. Oh, where else could it be? If it isn't right in my eyes. I mean, I just, okay. I was saying it'd be impossible to miss. And somehow, I haven't quite seen it. Here we go. It's right at the top. Bundum, what's gonna happen? Managed to restrain him somehow. But Link, I am not sure you'll be able to stop him. Master Sword. You're telling me that Link is safe? You traveled through time to find me and recover your strength. <gasps> Zelda, I believe there is a reason you were sent to us. It has to mean something. I know why I am here. It's something only I can do. We will finally stop him. <sighs> to become an immortal dragon is to lose oneself. I'll 
be forever changed. Link! You must find me. Um, I'm not sure what to think of that. Exactly. <laughs> so, it did the thing about the immortal dragon. So, does she become... That's one of the one I had. So does she actually do that? Become the immortal dragon? So to become this, the dragon is to lose oneself. Hm. Spinning gears. Okay. So this is going to be a little bit of... Well, I know what to do with this. You just... You just grab it. Okay, it lands right here every time. Okay, honestly, you probably need to do this. I don't know what... Oh yeah, that's what it'd do. It just seems so obvious that that's what you would do. There we go. Okay. This one, you push the little gears. Let's get the big hands. And it moves the big gears. Oh. Can't believe they made such an easy last one. That's weird. Even for them, not gonna lie. Do they give me anything? Like give me literally anything. Actually, I know what to do. This is quite logical. So, you see this, how it is. Actually, wait. Let's have this going backwards. This is quite a logical um, puzzle. And this makes me think of like trying to start a machine or something. You gotta crank it. Okay, so now. Shoe is. Oh, shoot. You simply go this. You can see my struggle, can't you? Awesome. That was an easy one. I like those easy shrines. The ones where you just do simple physics. And it's like, yep, I know that. The Light of Blessings. Ta -dum. Okay, so that one is cleared. So we got one out of four done. We have... Just a couple more to do. We have three more. So let's teleport right to it. There's no point in not. It's like I got the fast travel. Might as well use it. But man, there's just so many different shrines that I found. That it almost is just like... Yeah, let's just get them all. Okay, just go and do it.
Yeah, there's a giant chasm right there. Shining and darkness. You know what? I may have to use this just because I really don't feel okay so I just have to find the key you know I got that giant thing that just looks like a trap I why does this have to be a labyrinth? Maybe it won't go all the way. Yeah, I'm good. I find this very suspicious. Please be a key. Excellent memory. <laughs> Actually, maybe there's a bunch of small keys. Let me... No, I found the small key I needed. Might as well scavenge all I can, right? Wonder what's in here. Maybe something good. Okay, maybe I should just go to the ending. Like, nothing's getting done. Hopefully this is it. I mean, that wasn't too bad, I don't think. For a shrine. It almost seemed easy, you could say. No, but we're just going to town, just one after another, just getting them done. So I think I'm going to do the Sky Archipelago one next. Simply because that one's going to take a while, but I wanted to do that other one. Like, I wanted to go from straight from there all the way to there. So I'm like, well, I might as well just do that next. And then I wanted to get this tower. So if I do that in the next episode, what I was planning to do in the last episode, I'm perfectly fine with that. It's the moon. Okay, let's go to the sky. Yep, so this is three. If we get this done real quick, then I'll be like, eh, might as well just do the other one, but I don't think we can get this done in like eight, maybe ten minutes. If we're lucky, we could get this in ten minutes. Looks like a boss battle or something. Not even gonna lie. Yeah, it just kind of looks like a boss battle. Not necessarily my favorite, but it's cool. I'm fine with a boss battle any day of the week. Okay, it's one of them box guys. They ain't too difficult. And then there's some rockets, it looks like that I can use to get back to where I need to go. Let 
Uh, let's see. Okay, I do have a good weapon equipped. From what I can see. And I have the correct power. Okay, it's only level one. Flex contra. Oh, shoot, I literally had a hold of the... Give me. Oh my goodness, I am stupid. I do not know why. Just eat some food, you're being stupid. You keep clicking the wrong buttons. So, this is a stupid easy boss, and you're being dumb. something I can fuse with. Let's see, how good of a fuse is that? I think it does 20, usually. Uh, let's get some weak weapon. Oh my God. <laughs> now I have a super magic rod. That's nothing crazy. Okay, so that was the easy part. Now I'm trying to figure out how to get my butt over there. And that's gonna be a little bit more difficult. Um, not necessarily getting my butt over there, but getting this thing over there. That's a little bit more difficult. So let's see how many rockets. This one has two. So I figure you only need two if this one only has two. Why is this one floating higher? Okay, this one. Let's go up. That'll give me the height. And now. Guess if I go like, can you do this? Something like this? Where like, give you the distance? You know, it's close enough. I'm thinking I should be able to get this crystal. Let's lay it right down where it needs to go. Good job. Actually, that only took like five minutes. Um, I'm, I am surprised. But I think I'll do what I was planning to do. Like in the next episode, just like do that one shrine or whatever. I need to do some housework. If, if you get what I mean. What? Okay, wait. It is. It said to have been weirded by an ancient who awoke latent power and gems. Okay, I think it's basically like an empty slate, and you can add whatever you want to it. Like you can add fire, ice, whatever material you want, and you can have any type of magic rod. I just made it a crappy weapon. So, did I use it properly? No. Um, hopefully it gets good use as like an axe. I don't know. I'll just try to make some use out of it. Okay, let's go to inventory because let me count. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, I got at least six. 
Or five. At least five. Let's see. Any, like, crazy strong stuff? I know I have that Gibbos. Um. Which, but those only give you, like, one or two attack. It's like, yeah, it's 50. Okay, this one's 27. Which I knew about. But I didn't know if there was anything new that I, okay that's 26 that I had gotten that is strong I think diamond might be relatively new to me I think it's actually decently strong diamond I guess I would have to look and see what it is okay this is just a bunch of Stuff that's weak. I okay here. Twenty five is what a diamond does. Not bad by standards, but at twenty seven, Boss Book Hoplin is still better. One two three four five and drop. Drop them down. Get this. I've killed like so many of those. Clip. <laughs> See a traveler's claim, a soldier's claim. Oh, yeah. Mm, I guess I'll do one more. This thing's just a piece of crap. Yeah, that does throw really far. Okay, um. And drop. Equip and equip. now we have a couple more weapons. Not bad. So let's teleport to where I want to go, and then I'll just go ahead and end it there. Uh, wait, it's this one, right? This one ain't the closest. This is the one by Hyrule Castle. That was kind of creepy to go to. I don't know. But I did need to get more weapons no matter what. Because I kind of had a bunch of crappy. Like none were fused. But what I just did now should last me a long time. Unless I go against a giant boss. Which way would I find one of those? So yeah. Well, any guy, anyway guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!